Um, for me, of course, the graffiti is a um, have a different uh, relation with the politic. Nothing's different because for me, the graffiti is a kind of the word that should be underground, that should be illegal, that should be the like a hidden work. Um, so I think when I'm thinking about a graffiti, I'm thinking about a politic. See, uh, uh, when we're thinking about a graffiti, may sometimes you are confused because sometimes we think, uh, okay, uh, when the graffiti artist make, a, for example, the graffiti on a wall, maybe the owner of the building or owner of the wall not uh, be angry with the graffiti, you know. But the graffiti, in another time, we have the graffiti like art that should be free free that from everything, from the rules and regulation. So I think uh, uh, we should uh, have a difference between the vandalism and the graffiti. Sometimes we have a kind of a graffiti that should that destroy just the wall, you know, then, then without any static, without any meaning. It's just like, a, you know, like, a, um, of course, propaganda, or like uh, I said, one that is that young people make uh, some tag, I don't know, some, something that's not, not beautiful. So uh, if you think that graffiti, the real graffiti is beauty, real graffiti is uh, um, uh, have a meaning, real graffiti have to engage with the politic, I think uh, the wall should be victim and the owner should be victim of the, this relation. And, uh, I get the right to the painter to make a graffiti on a wall. Every people and can have a, the uh, different influence and a different meaning from the wall. Somebody, uh, maybe when you look at the one graffiti, sometimes, uh, for example, I get a politic meaning from the wall. Sometimes uh, my friend, for example, when he watches the wall, uh, he gets like a static and like, you know, like a good feeling to watch the spray and watch the color, you know. It's based on the people, of course. But I think um, uh, for myself, like a choose, I like to, uh, when I look at the graffiti, I like to be in thinking way. And I like to... Uh, uh, you know, look me, like, uh, you know, shocked me and they say, oh, never time I didn't think, or never time I didn't thinking about this subject. For example, uh, when the graffiti artists, uh, they are against, for example, the equalization, non-equalization, they are against, the, for example, the freedom speech. And some topic like that, with an artistic way, I have a very, uh, you know, excited. I'm very excited to watching the, 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 this kind of the graffiti. So I think it's based on the people. Everybody can have a different view and a different um, point of view to the graffiti. Unfortunately, uh, not just for the painting, for all of the underground uh, art, like underground music, uh, capitalism finally uh, get all of the things to themselves, you know. Uh, um, I can say capitalism, eat it, you know, eat the graffiti, you know, eat the uh, um, uh, underground art, everything. Uh, we don't have any uh, choose, unfortunately, but I think about uh, maybe uh, the way to stay the graffiti like a uh, real uh, graffiti uh, because when you think that maybe uh, the graffiti is the, like a tool of the capitalism or the government you know because for example in Iran we have some kind of the graffiti that uh, it's, it's, it's a graffiti for just for the propaganda is a graffiti for the government so I think what happened to the artist not for the art because the art is not for anybody and all of the people can use the pure art for everything they want. For example, I use the graffiti for law. 
somebody use the graffiti for money somebody use the graffiti for power so you know but I think about the artists what happened to artists that uh, can sell themselves to money to power to government you know we should thinking about that and we should research about that you know sometimes um, um, based on the what we're talking some some of the graffiti artists they are under the pressure of the money they don't have the money they don't have uh, any things you know uh, they, sh they have to study they have to for example working a lot and then they buy the spray with their self money they buy everything by self money so finally so maybe they have to um, go to the inside the hook of the capitalism you know so uh, I think uh, of course we, we cannot accept this kind of the graffiti like a real graffiti uh, but I'm sure uh, every generation have a new graffiti artist in, in graffiti art we talk like a film yeah. like a poem like you know every generation have a new uh, f the skill of uh, artists in every kind of um, branch so uh, of course when I see the the graffiti like a uh, advertise or propaganda or I don't like and I say just I am so sorry and that you, you you lost your way because it's not your real way and you should come back and you should start again maybe yes of course you see uh, we, for example in graffiti we have a lot of the artists uh, for example in the US like uh, Obey you know it's different with uh, for example blue you know thinking about that and, and not just in the in a personal life thinking about the topic about the graphic about the material that they use for example they make a t-shirt and they sell it you know and the blue just make a graffiti not for the fun for thinking like a philosophy you know I, I saw the one important blue graffiti in Berlin all of the time I thinking about uh, how do it you know how they do it really because it's like a um, uh, the very very you know deep thinking about about life so um, yes uh, we can say uh, capitalism not capitalism power on the money get everything you know and the mix with uh, themselves and then improve it in a way that they want you know they uh, for example uh, for gra in graffiti for example they uh, get the wall for the graffiti artist to make a graffiti just in a specific place, you know, in not in every place. You have a, this wall, like a free wall, you can paint in everything you want. And we know that police, police like a, a arm of the power, uh, control, you know, control the us. And then, for example, uh, they let us to make a festival, like a festival for street arts because I cannot watch the festival of Suninas and the people can come and visit the graffiti artists like uh, faces of the graffiti artists I cannot understand because the graffiti artists should be hidden you know um, so um, is a kind of the improved by the money and the power um, as I told you for me the engage between the politics and the graffiti is the first topic so I think they should be responsible for everything they should react to everything that happened in the society for example if today we have a the bombing if we have a the, for example terrorism if you have a for example the non-equalization against for example Muslim or against Christian or against every Zauristian we should the graffiti artist should react it you know uh, we have the, the one of the, my friend that he's graffiti artist and I love him because every time we have it uh, every day we have it uh, for example the the breaking news not just like, like a big breaking news the breaking news like a for example attack to the one labor he react immediately and we have for example tomorrow we have the graffiti animal about this topic so I think it's a kind of the social responsibility is a kind of the duty uh, about the society that we should do uh, of course, uh, I think we have a static for the ugly things. Why not? You know, of course, 
I don't think that so all, all of the uh, okay uh, before everything we should ask ourselves what kind of the art is ugly sometimes yes we have uh, some art that uh, for example 20 years ago it was so ugly but now the aesthetic after people change and we say wow it's so beautiful about for example uh, a photo you know for example in photo and uh, in uh, what to say um, uh, compose what you say in English um, the structure you know for example the I don't know um, the best place for the people like a uh, mise um, uh, in the cinema you know we have uh, this photo like the, okay this photo is so beautiful now but I'm sure for example five fifteen years ago it was not uh, not accepted by the people because it was no it's not true because you know, so we should we should ask what is it the ugly and then we can talk get thinking about it I think nothing is not ugly and we have a static of the ugly things of course when you are in contact with uh, some the very big problem or, or genocide you cannot be more static and more beauty you know you should be like the like the genocide like the, you know the big problem for example inside the war you cannot have uh, the camera like a uh, very you know uh, i don't know on uh, very beauty uh, uh, shot and you know of course you should you should have uh, the hand camera and you should run in you know so it's like like a graffiti artist sometimes we see the graffiti that the graffiti artist made it very fast and it is not so beauty but of course i cannot accept, accept it because maybe police attack and he wants to just finish it so uh, just i have a problem with on um, meaning i have a problem with uh, graffiti without any meaning without any topic then everything can be uh, with my idea can everything you see can be beautiful and can be important of course for myself no you know uh, when I'm thinking about my work um, I choose just the one way and I am responsible for every art that I did it for every creativity that I did it so I cannot thinking about uh, some people that they have they have a uh, two or three faces you know uh, and I, of course I cannot understand but sometimes we have uh, some people I cannot say them artists but my idea is not the final idea in the world it's just the personal idea for example uh, in my personal life uh, I made a film about a graffiti and the, um, I sentenced it to, to jail so for example I can make a film about a graffiti and they make a film for government and they stay free and just you know so it's not possible because I'm one personality I ha don't have the person different personality that for example during the day I choose this one and I you know I divert the clothes based on the, this personality and during the night I put the you know the, the so I think uh, it's not possible and I cannot uh, really I cannot understand this kind of the people see I think uh, the graffiti in future um, I, I don't know when we talk about the future actually then but we can uh, say in future the graffiti change not just in meaning in the structure in instrument that the people use the graffiti artists use for example maybe in future they don't use a spray maybe they use a, the some new uh, instrument that it's not in our mind you know for example the, I'm thinking about graffiti in 50 years ago until now the, in, in the past that we have just stencil graffiti the people you know cut the sub ships and they make a spray but now we have a different one we have a different name we have a different technique you know so i think but i'm sure as i told you every generation they have the new style um, new artists new topic and i'm sure the graffiti continue to the work uh, because it's the it's a kind of new painting style that for the people of course and and uh, it's uh, the graffiti is so child not young so child is just it's the first step of the 
graffiti, I'm sure it will be the more and the more improved. For example, I'm thinking about a Mexican painter. Of course, they are not graffiti artists, but um, I think about wall painting totally that uh, uh, work. And I think uh, every year in the, the graffiti and the wall painting change and the change. So maybe um, uh, in the close future, we have a kind of the graffiti like a, a graffiti, for example, a, a mountain, you know, why not? Or graffiti on an aircraft, you know? Why not? Like, not like a just uh, illegal graffiti. Maybe that the uh, meaning of the illegal and the legal graffiti will be changed. You know, maybe I don't know, but I'm sure uh, with a new world, with a new uh, um, uh, information, and of course the new space, uh, everything will be changed uh, because. Uh, uh, the science uh, grow up and the science every day develop. And I'm sure uh, in other side, other art like a cinema, for example, 3D and you know, um, in painting we have a lot of the change in future.